Good morning, good people. This is your Poolproof Wisdom Moment. It's Friday, and wow, what a week it's been. This is going to be a quick Poolproof Wisdom Moment that I hope you'll carry with you into the weekend, through the week ahead, and forever. You know, there is no guarantee to figuring out how to have a happy life. There really isn't. There are a lot of tried and true reasons and rationales that many people have used. But today, I want to offer you three things that if you apply them and keep them in mind as you walk through your life every day, it will help you at least get somewhat happier than you may be if you are not already doing these things. So, very simply, if you want to live a happy life, you've got to find the way to not let your life be defined by your past, other people, and money. Isn't that amazing? Think of it. Right there, in a nutshell for you, is the secret. The past, people, and money. Don't let your life be about how those circumstances and those attributes affect you. Because if you do, that's how you get into that depressive state where you feel like nothing is enough, you're not good enough, you don't have enough. Start ignoring those things and instead focus on the great lively activities that define your life. The people who care for you, for whom you care. What you have versus what you want. And, of course, remembering that if you live in this moment, in this present, and you plan for the future to the extent you can, you don't have to worry about what was in the past. It's there. It always will be. But you don't have to reside there with it. Step forward into your future by acknowledging your present and living with all intention in mind. That's your Poolproof Wisdom Moment for today. Find me on Spotify, on Apple and Google Podcasts, on Anchor FM, new episode uploaded today. And of course, if you're interested in the great book, you can, of course, look for my audio book, I Am My Own Cause, The Third Act, Surviving and Thriving, on Audible or PoolproofBooks.com. Happy Friday, everybody. I hope you all have a fantastic weekend.